welcome problem solving fans to another problem of the day and this one's all about a hotel buying some eggs for everyone's breakfast well we get told that eggs are sold in boxes of 10 and you can see by the picture that there are 10 eggs inside that box now a hotel is going to need a lot of eggs to make everyone's breakfast for the week and they need 1753 eggs for the week so we've got to figure out what's the smallest number of boxes of eggs that the hotel needs to buy for the week. So basically what we need to do is figure out how many of these tens actually go in to 1,753. How many lots of 10 or how many boxes of 10 will we need to get to make it up to 1,753? So what we've got to do really is a quick divide. So how many tens go into 1,753? And we can do that in a bus shelter division. So how many 10s will squeeze into one? Well, 10 won't squeeze into one because 10 is bigger than one. So it won't go in there. But because it wouldn't go in there, we haven't really used the one. So we carry the one along to make 17. 10s into 17 goes once. That's 10. And there's 7 left over. So you carry the 7 across to make 75. How many 10s into 75? Well, 7 10s are 70. So obviously that would leave 5 left over. And that's how many 10s into 53? Well, 5 10s are 50 with 3 left over. So the 3 is a remainder. But we should now start to write remainders as fractions. So that remainder of 3 would also be divided by 10. So it's 175 and 3 tenths. Now, what we need to do now is interpret what this actually means. So, the 175 is 175 full boxes of eggs. And the 3 tenths is 3 tenths of a box. So, not a, that's not a full box, in other words. Only three, we'd only need an extra 3 eggs out of the next box. But obviously you can't just buy three tenths of a box. You can't go to the supermarket when they sell boxes of ten eggs and say, well, I don't want the box of ten. I only want three. Life just simply doesn't work like that. So because we need an extra three from another box, we can't just buy 175 boxes. This three tenths of a box is an extra box. So we must buy the 175 boxes plus one extra box that will contain the three extra eggs, and that makes a total of 176 boxes. So the final answer is 176 boxes. Of course, once we've used those three eggs out of that final box, there would actually be seven eggs left 